。NEDO は日本最大級の研究開発マネジメント機関です。国内での研究開発とともに、海外での実証事業を行っています。これからは需要側の制御による導入拡大、再生可能エネルギーの導入拡大を目指した技術の実証を行っていくべきだと考えてこのプロジェクトを企画しました需要の中でも今後ますます需要が増えるであろう空調に関するエネルギー消費を抑えるためポルトガル国の代表的な研究機関であるルーネグそしてリスボン市との協力のもと空調機器の制御によるデマンドレスポンスを実現するものでございます。Since the beginning of the 20th century, all power is generated from central power plants and transmitted along the transmission distribution grid until the end user. But as we begin to integrate more and more renewable energy generation, like solar and wind, into our electric grid, the grid is slowly making a transition from a traditional vertically integrated electrical grid to a modern power grid. Also, due to the rise of the new connected technologies, consumer is becoming a prosumer. As progressively people generate their own power through rooftop solar panels or drive electrical vehicles. However, generation output by renewable resources is governed by environmental conditions, inherently intermittent. On top of this, Renewable resources are generally not able to respond to changes in demand. Consequently, it drives a greater need for authorities to procure more ancillary services for grid balance by having the demand adjusting to the production. This is the basis of demand response. Demand response support. Allows generators and loads to interact in an automated fashion in real time and can be provided by industrial, commercial, and residential loads. In order to implement demand response systems, the system operator must be able to coordinate large numbers of distributed resources effectively and send a signal to each asset. エネルギー消費の大きい空調機を IoT 技術を使ってアグリケーションすることによって効果的にコントロールすることで電力グリッドの需給調整に貢献できる部分は大きいというふうに考えています再生可能エネルギーが拡大していく今後においてデマンドサイドから見た需給調整モデルの確立、検証、普及を目指していきたいと思っています今回のネド実証事業においてダイキン工業はプロジェクト全体の設計、マネジメント空調機器の導入と制御システムの構築を行っていますさらには蓄冷機器を用いたデマンドレスポンスの可能性評価についても取り組んでいますデマンドレスポンス対応の空調機及び蓄冷タンクの備えた空調機の開発さらにはクラウドシステムの開発ソラーを通じてデマンドサイドにおける需給調整能力つまりフレキシビリティの提供価値の定量評価を行います本プロジェクトにおいては自動デマンドレスポンスの実証をポルトカルの電力会社である EDP をはじめパートナー企業としてエバリス社、エファセック社とともに実施していますまたバーチャルパワープラントに関する実証・評価を三井物産、アラップ、ネクストクラフトベルケといったヨーロッパにおける実証パートナーとともに実施しておりまたそれらを通じたビジネスモデルの事業性評価にも取り組んでいます Daikon Portugal has participated since the very beginning of this project throughout the feasibility study, sharing our expertise on VRV installation. As the project moved forward, Daikon Portugal was responsible for the installation, commissioning, and maintenance of the VRV systems in phase one and the tank units in phase two. O NEG, desde a primeira hora, uh, uh, se interessou pelo projeto, não só pelo. pela área ou as áreas que este projeto envolve e eu destacaria a seguinte importância representa a, a possibilidade de testar não só as tecnologias mas perspectivar a sua integração na área dos edifícios automated demand response é precisamente uma nova forma de uma nova abordagem 
à gestão do, uh, dos consumos dos edifícios. E estes resultados vão ajudar o cidadão a ter edifícios mais confortáveis, espera-se com resultados a nível económico bastante mais satisfatórios para, para todos nós. É isto que eu espero que este projeto vá demonstrar. Eu queria realçar que a Câmara Municipal de Lisboa se associou a este projeto por aquilo que ele significa em termos de sustentabilidade, em termos de inovação e em termos de melhoria das condições de trabalho que eh, funcionam nestes eh, edifícios que estão abrangidos no protocolo. E devo felicitar as equipas de ambos os eh, parceiros por aquilo que conseguiram eh, aportar a este projeto. Lisboa tem vindo progressivamente a ser conhecida em termos internacionais pelos projetos que tem em termos de preservação ambiental. Claramente este projeto insere-se também nessa lógica de que Lisboa seja uma cidade ambientalmente cada vez mais sustentável e cada vez mais agradável de viver, de trabalhar e de visitar. As sponsorship of this demonstration project, Lisbon City and Runeg for all support in making the project in the reality and for providing the demonstration buildings. And many thanks to our partners uh, on their effort by uh, in implementing this project. Today, in the presence of the Honorable Fernando Medina, uh, Mayor of Lisbon, His Excellency Jun Nimi, Ambassador Extraordinary and Plenipotentiary of Japan, we are very pleased to celebrate today's opening ceremony of the Automated Demand Response Demonstration Project. I'd like to praise LUNEG, NEDO, ADP, EFASEC, Everish, and Daikin, and all of you who made every effort to start the operation of this project. Uh, this is a great project. The first reason is that sustainability is the key word of our time, or precisely in a moment where many in the world, or some in the world, doubt of the importance of politically caring about sustainability. We have to look, because what is happening, it's not a tale of the future. Climate change is a tale of the present. <laughs>